Hello everybody, I'm your host Keenan Basma and today joining us on the studio is FHS Deputy Principal, Mr. Clements. Well, with that, let's start asking you some questions. Sure. So first question, uh, where did you go to high school and what was high school like for you? you know, was it different from today? So I went to Stoughton High, although my loyalties are clearly here with the Panthers. Um, I graduated in 98. And probably the biggest difference, if you look um, at the Chromebooks that we have today and Google Classroom and all that, I remember a teacher asking me um, what was my source and I was told you can't use anything online. That's not real. Go find an encyclopedia. Huh. So it was a lot old school back then. I think so, yeah. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. Um, so why did you get involved in education? So it's probably a combination of a couple of things. Um, I'm the oldest of four kids, so there was always that little element of kind of naturally looking after my siblings mm -hmm. and teaching, but it was really my 10th grade English class with Mr. Dennison, and we were reading Lord of the Flies, and I remember realizing that it was more than just a bunch of kids on an island, mm -hmm. and thinking that this is pretty cool, that's something I'd want to do. I love that book. Yeah. It's a very classic book. Um, so what makes your role as a deputy principal different from an assistant principal. Sure. So probably the biggest difference is nobody really knows what a deputy principal does. I get that question <laughs> a lot. Um, I refer to myself as the guy with the office next to Mr. Perry and I go, yeah. oh, okay, yeah, 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 yeah. But we've got three house offices, three assistant principals. They all have a kind of a set group of kids. But in some ways, I'm more a little bit like Mr. Perry in that it's all the kids, all the time, anything anybody needs. If Mr. Perry's out, I'll cover for him. If the APs mm -hmm. need help, I'll help with them. And it's a little bit of everything. It's actually dynamite. Yeah, it sounds hectic. Like it is. Everywhere. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my gosh. Um, well, with that, what is one thing you like about your job? The kids. The kids are the best part of the day. Mm -hmm. um, sometimes if I'm stuck in meetings or having a tough day or a little frustrated, I'll just get out. I'll just get into the hallways. I'll see the kids. I'll pop into a classroom and remind myself why this beautiful building is here and what we're doing. Yeah, it's good to take a little break and I'm glad you said that. Mm -hmm. um, is there one thing you wish you knew as a high school student that you know now? Um, I think I made life a little bit more difficult for myself in high school than I needed to. Yeah. I didn't always respond appropriately to conflict. A lot of times if I had a disagreement with a teacher, I would kind of shut down and make things a little harder for me and sometimes for that teacher. And now with what I do all the time is working and helping navigate relationships and intent versus impact and just making things run more smoothly. I wish I had known then what I know now. Gotcha. I think that's advice everyone can use. I think so, yeah. Um, what, uh, you know, what is one thing you like to do like when you're not working, you know, on your free time? Sure. So one thing that I haven't done yet that I would love to do is to go fly fishing with Mr. Lestage, but he has yet to invite me. Um, in terms of what I actually do, um, my home life's a little crazy too. I actually have four kids um, with uh, number five is due on the way in May. So yes. that will be, uh, it, it's a little hectic there too. That yeah. kind of consumes all my time. That, I mean, that's exciting. Though. Yeah. Kids, gotta love kids. Um, now, what is one word that describes your experience here at FHS? Uh, varied. Yeah. No day is the same. Mm -hmm. I could walk in thinking I know I'm going to do one thing, something totally different, um, but varied and interesting every gotcha. day. That's a, I actually like that response a lot. And uh, lastly, is there anything you would uh, like to share about yourself that we don't know? I have played the trumpet for years. Oh. I have played ultimate frisbee. And until I was about four or five years old, nobody knew if I was going to be right or left-handed. Wow, that is, that is actually very interesting. <laughs> <laughs> well, Mr. Clements and FHS, that's all the time we have for today. I want to say thank you for coming on the of show. Of course. It's been a pleasure. Thank you. And to FHS, have a great day.